What's up folks, uh, my name is Kyle, coming to you today. We're gonna go look at a new car. Um, hopefully pick it up today. And uh, from here, uh, we, I have plans to do good things to this car. And hopefully you'll join me along the way and watch how this car progresses from where it is now to where I want it to go and things like that. Uh, suggestions that you may have also, um, whether we go which way with this. So stay tuned. I will reveal the car ahead of this and uh, you'll see what I'm getting to. All right, guys. So today was a successful day. I was able to get my car. I'm gonna show you pictures of it or a video of it soon. Unfortunately, it started raining and soon as all the paperwork got signed and everything and it's killing me because the car is or was clean. So it is killing me at this point to drive her home. And um, I guess it's gonna need a bath again. Um, hopefully, I, I got a guy who does some really great detail work on, uh, detail work, and uh, I think I'm going to have him detail the car up, Teflon coat it, get it nice and ready uh, for whatever. Um, but anyways, um, I'm super excited. It's been a while since I've uh, owned a car like this. Um just feels good you know after time and I took some time off with newer cars and stuff uh, you know so it feels good to be back in the game again and uh, I can't wait to do the things I want to do to it and um, it's gonna be a lot of fun I'm gonna enjoy it and um, stay tuned I will sh reveal the car what it is and uh, I can't wait to see what you guys think about it but uh, till then I'll be back all right everybody what's up uh, sorry I could not finish the video yesterday uh, the rain came in and it was uh, just pouring for the whole day so I could not uh, I didn't want to reveal the car being all dirty and everything so I just got it all cleaned up and uh, it's looking good um, so without any further ado let me introduce to you guys her name is phantom now you can see it's a 2016 camaro she's all black looking nice and right um see here she's looking good looking real good so I couldn't be more stoked with her. Um, she's running good, looking good, and uh, she's a pleasure to drive, and I enjoy the hell out of it. Now, I'm gonna be doing a bunch of things to this. Uh, you will, uh, it will be getting uh, soon. It's already been ordered. An intake, uh, headers, full length exhaust. Um, probably gonna keep the muffler, the original muffler for right now. Uh, I'm thinking that, um, I'll run it, see if I like it. Um, it seems pretty loud, but you know, I've been watching the videos just like everyone does here on YouTube. And uh, you know, you can distinguish whether or not you like your sound, whether or not you want louder, or you're good with what it's got. So before I spend any more extra money on a muffler system, um, I'm gonna run it, see if I like it. And then, you know, of course, in the back there, they got the, the flat uh, pieces of exhaust that gotta be fixed on there. So that has to be done also. And uh, I'll have all that done. But um, yeah, she's a, she's a beauty, as you can see. And you know, uh, like I said, the first thing that it's gonna do is it is going to go down. It needs to come down about, uh, about an inch or so. So definitely has to come down a little bit. And then, um, but that'll probably be after the exhaust. Uh, it's gotta be sounding right first, an intake. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a baseline tune on this car, on the car, see where it stands. Um, you know, everyone's right around, I guess, 360-ish, I would think, probably at the wheel. Um, we'll see. 
So uh, I'll try to um, update as I go here with everything at, that I do. Um, I'm gonna try to do dyno runs um, with the basic bolt-ons, like each bolt-on. Um, I'll probably, um, I'll, like I said, I'll do the base tune on this, and then I'll put the headers and exhaust on and do a dyno run on that so that you can just see what the headers and exhaust run on there. And then I'll do the cold air intake or uh, maybe I'll do the cold air intake before I do the headers just so you can see what that is. Just, just a simple, that's probably the cheapest upgrade that you can do is probably the cold air intake. Although they range anywhere from about 270, 280 K and N air filter all the way up to like five, 600 bucks, which is, I don't know. That seems like a lot of money for a cold air intake. I don't know how much more horsepower you're gonna gain, but I would probably say your two first best mods would be the cold air intake, get it breathing right, uh, if you guys live in the area that has flex fuel, um, like E85, I'd definitely probably get that, and that would work. Um, that will be uh, a good um, upgrade also. You could probably get about another 20 horse out of them, 30 horse. Now, you have to tune your car for that. You cannot just stick it in and put E85 in. You make sure you got a tune in there, otherwise the car will not run right i don't even know what will happen to it but i know all i've heard is you do not want to do that so keep that in mind but uh i'm gonna wrap this up um i'll keep up the progress on this i hope you guys like what you see so if you do hit the like button subscribe and um follow me on my journey with my car and you guys can add your comments and everything like that and your journey with your car and um you know that's what cars are about and uh building relationships with people and things and you know you meet people that you don't even know uh, that you would become friends with but uh that's what cars do to bring everybody together and uh one last time i guess right she is uh looking good so i like what i like what i see and i hope you guys do too thanks